And finally, it's Buzz Tex. Apparently, he's the one that everyone's saying, ooh, get balls on. Hey, mate. How you doing, mate? How about a while? Long time. Long time? Have we spoken before? Yeah. You did a video, I think. You said you was going to put it out on YouTube a while back. Did I kick you off? I don't know what you did. Probably did. Okay. So, why would you have kicked me off? I don't know. I've just got this kind of spidey senses tingling. Okay. Don't worry. It's not going to be tough for you today. I'm going to be nice with you. It's never tough for me, mate. But continue. It's not going to be tough, so you're not going to kick me then, right? I don't kick people because it's tough for me. Okay, then. So, guys, when he starts going tough and he kicks me, there's the answer, yeah? Uh, when you start waffling and <laughs> making no sense, or the point's been answered and you're just trying to flog a dead horse, then you may well get kicks. But anyway, I, go, I, make, make your point, I don't mind. Why okay, is it? Got okay. So, all this three you've been going on about... <laughs> EDL, Tommy. Um, what have been, what, what, been saying? What have been saying? Well, you've been saying you want people up here to do with what this match was all about, what people are protesting for. That was the, yeah, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I, I, okay, yeah. So let, let's okay. it's good. You're the guy I'm looking for. Okay. So I want to know what the protest is about, who you protested yeah. against, okay. and what kind of outcome you're fishing for. Okay. That type so, of thing. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay. So you're aware of? Uh, have you seen any videos recently of Tommy or not? Uh, ish. Go on. Uh, did any of them stay, does, does any of them say anything to do with Muslims? To do with like that's what we match you for. Um, ish. Go on. Uh, no, does it? Does it? Yes or no? Does I, I don't know. know. I've, I've not really paid attention. Go on. Tommy's right hand man, as we all know, is Danny Tomo. You've, you know this guy? Yeah, I know Danny Tomo. Yep, Danny Tomo clearly states in a video why he's doing it, which he clearly states is to do with knife crime. Mm -hmm. um, okay, he didn't say anything about Muslims. What I want to know is, um, why are Muslims at the moment making it out? Apart, please forgive me, right, for saying this, but it's like they're playing victim because the, a mosque was attacked in Southport, but the mm. day after, Christians was there building the wall, helping them with it. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. I want to know what Muslims are playing victim here. Because I've been seeing a lot on TikTok. Why are Muslims getting blamed for this? Why are Muslims getting blamed no, for this? Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Let's address this. Okay. okay. There's so many memes talking about Islam. Yeah, yeah. So many memes. Okay. Yeah. Um, you attacked a mosque. Yeah. Broke a mosque, smashed it up. And if the who police did? didn't support, protect it, who knows what you'd have done who to did? it. All right. Okay. This who? Uh, right. Who? So this indicates you've got a problem with Muslims. Who? Who, me? No, no, whomever was in, in Southport. You. you said you. Well, we, we, you're not in Southport, no? Uh, I'm talking about the protests in Southport. You weren't there, no? Yeah, yeah, we're talking about the protests. What I'm saying is, yeah. Well, you're, saying, you're, saying, you're saying you, you said you. No, no, you. no, were you at the protests in Southport or not? Yeah, I was, yeah. You was. Did you help smash up the mosque? Did I help? Don't, don't be so silly. Right, did you stop the people doing it? Did you tell the people not well, to do well, it? Well, I don't know if you realise, but then people have bricks in their hands, my friend. All right. <laughs> you know, all right. You tell me, okay, did, so, you, did you come out and condemn it afterwards and say Absolutely. Look, I'll, I'll say it right now. And, I, and I'm and 95 you, you made videos and stuff, yeah, or not? Well, we, we, we've talked about it and we've, we've said right. it clearly. Okay. okay beautiful. That, that's so, fine then. But, but, so, so just like the terrorists, which have happened, and, you know, and people are saying, oh, it's to do with um, Islam and Muslims, all that. We can't label the whole of Muslims because of the terrorism, correct? Right. So you can't label, you can't label everybody there protesting because of a handful of dickheads. I, I, I'm not, I'm not labeling anyone. No, no, but that's what's happening on TikTok right now. No, the, the people... look, 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 I can't answer, look, look. I no, can't answer I'm, what people are I'm saying not. on social media. No, so just as, just as you can't. No, okay. You're posting. So I'm trying, I'm asking the question. What is the protest about? Who are you knife protesting crime? towards? Knife crime. Uh, knife crime with Danny Tomo clearly states. I don't see any marches in South London about knife crime. So you didn't just see that one in London there, no? That was not about knife crime in South well, London. Stay there, stay there, stay there. I'm going to play it. Stay there, please, you're please you're stay gonna play there. What? I'm going to play the, the speech that Danny Tomo um, gave right at the beginning of, the, uh, of it. He gave a two minute you're silence. Not, you're not, so you're, you're, yeah, look, 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 understand right, something. And then he said, we're here to protest about knife crime. All right, you're, you're, about you're, you're preaching to the choir, mate. All right, I have an issue with knife crime also. So. so there we go. So my point is, you're saying, I didn't hear anything. You, you just said, I didn't hear anything. Well, I, I, I didn't. You, I didn't. So I'm you're saying Tomo spoke about what's going on in Brixton? That's the or first what? thing he's... Listen, please, okay. please, please. It's, 
It's very important you listen. It's oh, important. Well, play it. Yeah, play it. Do you take offence by that, by the way? We want our country back. I don't even understand what it means, if you could explain oh, that to me. Let's get England back to the way it was. Maybe. All right, all right. Yeah, okay. so who, who's got your country right now? It's not about who's got our country, it's about the state of our country. No, but you're asking for your country back. Who's got it yeah, at the we moment? We want it back to how it was. And how was it? Well, it, what, it, we didn't see three children stabbed on, on the streets. Okay? Didn't we? Well, how far back are we going? Go on, then, in, in this century, go on, tell me. Dunblane. Is that in England? Scotland. Right, so in England. We want our country back. We're talking about oh, England. So, so the Scots, if it's something that happens in Scotland, that's not included. No, no, we're talking about England. We're in London, my friend. Where, where was Michael Ryan from? Hungerford. We're talking about three children. One second, one second, one second. seen it before? Yeah, yeah. What was, that? what was the name of that guy who killed little Haley and what, what was his name? Uh, Have you seen it before? No, what was his name? Who? The guy who killed the two little girls. Um, you want, you, the, you run about, um, what's this his name? Um, yeah, anyway, I'm getting back to the, no, I want to no, no, this. You asked me, you asked me, I'm telling you. So there's Hungerford yeah. from yeah. Michael Ryan. Yeah. There was yeah. um, those two little girls, yeah? You've got Fred West and, yeah. and Rose West doing whatever they did. Yeah, okay. I, I don't remember any, mm, okay. anything, okay. mentioning anything about that. But, oh, okay. so, there, there was no Rose Garden. You know, I remember back in the day, Jack, mm. the, the Yorkshire Ripper, um, you know, Peter in Sutcliffe. Hungerford. I remember yeah, that time. Hungerford, yeah. okay. How old are you, mate? Okay. I'm 36. Right, I'm 51. All right. So I, I go back. I've seen more of this country than you have. Yeah. I don't remember this scene you're thinking of. Oh, I'm not thinking of anything. Remember, remind me of a time when there was no crime and knife crime. And remind me. You want to go back to the craze? I thought no. you want to go back. Hang on. 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 Do you, are you saying there is no knife crime? Uh, there is no, no, no serious what knife I'm crime. What I'm saying problem. to you is this. You no, no, that's exactly crime. what you're saying. You're, you, are you not telling me, you're telling me that there isn't a rising knife crime right now? I, I'm saying to you right now, there was no time when there was no violent crime in the UK. Yes, I'm telling I'm you that now. I'm talking about yes. knife crime. There's a serious problem right now. Yes or no? Yeah, of course knife crime is a serious problem. Okay. But so we want our country back to where it wasn't this bad, okay? Yeah, but how are you going to do that? But, but, but that's what we're screaming. We oh, want okay, 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 okay. Let, let's, let's try to imagine this scenario. There was never a time. You want to go back to the 80s, got all the football hooliganism no, going on? not like this, Amzo. You're not getting it. Not I, like I, this. I am getting it. I, I'm getting it, right? No, you There not. was no utopia that you're thinking of. I'm not saying utopia. Right, right, I'm right. I'm saying the way the country was compared to now is a real mess. Right, now. so give me the year you're talking about that we want no, to get no, back to. When I was growing up as a child in this country, we didn't have to fear about knife crime, okay? I tell we you didn't. that now. We didn't, but now we do, because there's kids running around with knives. There's always been kids running around with knives, well, mate. When I, well, okay then. It, so what you're saying is there's nothing changed, yeah? Uh, I, I'm saying that I, the only thing I would say that's changed, to be yeah. honest, if you want to talk about an actual change, is that the youth are more brazen. You know, when we was younger, we, we adults were a little bit daunting, but now they'll mouth off. Yeah, first thing, because corporal put it. Because I remember in school we got battered. Yeah, then corporal mm. punishment was taken out of schools. Got Therefore, there was one second, one second. Then the rights for parents to chastise their children was removed as well. So you you took the you took the um, yeah. the, you took the the rights away from the school to punish mm. children in school. You took the rights away from the parents to chastise their children. Now you've got a problem because now who's going to control the children? Because now no one can control the children. Okay. And then the children realize that. This is the first thing. Mm. Second thing. I'm just, well, I'm trying just, to just, just listen to me, please. Okay. Okay. Because I understand what you're saying. Okay. There's and a, then we there's have. There's a knife crime, just admit. I'll be, I'll be honest with you, mate. Uh, I, I don't remember a time when there wasn't knife crime. Is there a rising I don't knife crime? Yes. Well, you need to understand politics a bit more, guys. I think everyone in the chat could agree there's a rising knife crime. Yes or no? But I've seen. No, no. I'm, can I explain to myself to you? Are there I changes? Thought you I thought you were clever than this. I am. You I am there's a rising no, no, knife crime. No. Just say it. No, no, no. I'm being straight here, mate. And if you don't listen, you're not going to learn, are you? I'm asking you about. I'm sure well, I'm telling you the changes. Right answers. I'm telling you the changes I've seen. What's that got to do with you? There's a rising knife crime admit. What's it got to do with you if I'm telling you what I've seen change? You, you asked me a question, did you not? Know? Why can't you just say, yes, there is did a rising knife crime? Did you ask me a question or not? Yeah, is there a rising knife no, crime? Yes you or asked, not? Right, no, you said to me, 
Is it well, was it like, that, this is why he kicks me because he doesn't just answer the question? No, no, because the problem is, you see, you ask a question, I try to answer it, no, I don't give you no, your picture hold answer. Right, well, just answer it, yes or no? Oh, okay, I'm saying to you again, I don't remember a time, yeah, when there wasn't knife crime. Okay, I'm I don't saying, remember a time. There's always been knife crime, but there is a rise in it, That's right? Right, right, right. There's been, I'll tell you what, there's been a rise in. Here we go. Okay, now whether this is because I live in, uh, live in London now, because I've not always lived in London. Oh, uh, yeah. I, don't answer anything. Okay. You, you can't ask me about my anecdotal experience and what I fear. What? Why should I say, I'm yes, right, yeah, there has been a rise in knife crime? Where? Where, in, where has there been a rise in knife crime? Are you talking about inner city London? <laughs> where, where are we talking about here? Everywhere, the whole country right now is riddled with kids carrying knives. It's always has been. Okay, so there's not, you're saying there's no rise. Just say it. No, there isn't. Uh, you're asking me, have I, I'm telling you what I've seen a rise in. Okay, I've seen a rise in mobile phone theft. I've seen a rise in this moped, moped uh, you know, driving around, nicking stuff. Yeah, I've seen a rise in this thing, oh this this postcode flex. I'll be honest with you, the postcode flex, where you're from this postcode, that's code, and, and, and they they fight each other, and then they've got this. There's no rising, okay. Right. So, so, so saying, but this no, is because. There's no rise. Listen, listen, there's, no listen, rise listen there's, there's, there's no listen. rise. Listen. There's no rise. That's the answer. I just want to move on. I, I, I'll be honest with you, I don't remember time there wasn't. I remember... Yeah, no, so there's no rise. No, no, the word rise is not... He's not, he's not, he's not answering it, okay? So he's not... He's moving I, on. I, 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 no, whether, I there is, whether there no, is... Whether there is... Whether there is, whether there isn't. Whether there is, whether there isn't. I'm telling you now there's a rise and everyone oh, else... Oh, oh, okay. Can you give me the statistics, please? I don't... Mate, right now, we have seen time and time again in the papers, in the news, all up and down this country... I've seen my whole life, mate. News. I've seen him my whole life, mate. Okay, so there's no rise in your eyes. Right, now, let's get to my right. point, right? No, can you right. give me the statistics for this rise? Oh, look, we, we can all, we all know there's been a rise in knife no, crime. No, no, you can't and... just tell me we all know, okay, trust then, me, bro. Okay, then, okay. Do you have any okay. statistics or not? Well, let me get to my point. That no, can you give point. me statistics or not? I don't, I don't have the statistics, but right. it's clear. So you, it's just it's trust me, bro. Okay, okay, continue. Okay, continue. There's, no, there's, no, there's no rise crime. There's no rise in, in knife crime in Namza Z, right? So, what is wrong with Danny Tomo and the people pro protesting outside London telling, uh, telling the government to do more about knife crime? Forget about the rise, about knife crime. What's the problem? Say it again. Let me just, let me just, let, what no, is I'm, the problem with... I have no issue with that. I have got no issue with that. You've got no issue with uh, Danny Tomo and Tommy Robinson highlighting the fact that there's been knife crime going on. No, no, no issue with that at all, man. I don't like knife there crime. There we go, then. So, the, so there's your answer. You know you're asking everyone, I want to know what all this process is about. Is that there's what the process answer. is about? Well, yeah, well, you didn't need to start a live to that. You could have just Googled so, it on so, YouTube. So, so you're telling me that all these protests that are happening is because to stop knife crime? It's to highlight the fact that wow. the government have lost control of this country. So when these okay. knife amnesties occur, what are they all about? What are you on about? When the police do a knife amnesty and people hand in their knives and such, and they do them, oh, that's all they, need, they need to. They need to, don't they? Well, they, they do it anyway. More. So they need I'm, to do I'm, more I'm... of it. They need to do more of it because there's more. Right. There's, there's, so that's the protest. Stop the knife crime. It's not. Yeah, but that was that's what Danny Tomo well, highlighted. Why sing Allah? Thing. Allah, who the fuck is Allah? Well, again, that's a minority, isn't it? Why sing it though? Did Danny Tomo sing it? I don't know. Why did they sing it? Well, you stay. The boys in London. Oh, we're going to label them. All. Are we go label them all? Are we just like we're not allowed to label them? Why did anyone sing it? Why did anyone sing well, it? Why did anyone blow up, uh, blow up um, you know, 9-11 and all this? Why, do you know what I mean? We can't. It's a minority. What? It's a minority. We can't. All, all right. So you, you, you condemn those who sang that, yes? Absolutely. No, we oh, should be labelling Muslims. Good man. Good man. I'm, I'm, but listen, this is what That's I'm good. saying. You're doing well. You're doing well. Carry on. Listen, nobody should be labelling. Nobody should be labelling innocent Muslims um, bad, bad things. And that's what I stand for. That's, it's not about that. Okay. Right now, we have a real pandemic on our hands, which is children running around with knives, stabbing innocent people. That's what we're seeing time and time and time again. Okay? Mm. The country, whether you like it or not, it has been... You guys are all going to disagree with this. But I'll ask you all this question. If you're, if you, Are you happy that the uh, boats are coming in? Yes or no, Hamza? No. You're not? Yeah. One you're second, not. One second. You're not. Total knife. The highest amount of knife crime was in 2019. Okay. And it was equal. To, it was higher as well in 2018. It's more knife crime then. Okay. There we are. And so, then, what was it? One EDL guy arrested? Oh, not EDL. Sorry, forgive me. Go, one yeah. guy at the protest with you guys arrested for having seven knives on him. Uh, with us again, you're labeling us. Why? Your mark. Just, just like you guys that don't like being labeled as. Why is that, is that true? You're doing is exactly that, is that the same, but you don't like yourself. No, but is that true? Some guy. I don't your know. Demo. I, show me the evidence. I don't know. 
what, what show you the evidence of a guy getting arrested with seven knives on him yeah seven knives on him and yeah. nunchucks so, um, yeah, i don't know i don't know where was this at when was this a uh, uh, man arrested I'll t- i don't know i'll, I'll tell you man one second yeah. well, that's it sure i got i, I didn't see Should it named and shaped by you boys man no but you you, you talk about you, can't, you, don't, you think that there's no rising knife crime that's your problem well, I've just what? looked at the statistics, and there was yeah. more knife crime in 2019 yeah. than now. Okay. All oh, right. Well, there's not a problem then. The government. No, 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 no. There's not. No, I, have, I have an issue with crime as much as anyone else does. I get so that. Let's big up Danny Tomo and Tommy Robinson for highlighting the fact that there's a lot of knife crime going on, and they've tried to put a stop to it. Can we not do that? And how are they going to put a stop to it? Well, they're doing a lot more than you are right now, aren't they? They're trying to well, highlight well, the fact. Well, how, to... what, what are they doing? What are they, what, what are they calling for? What are they standing for? To put more legislation in place to stop, um, you know, to have police officers to have a, a more of a stop and uh, stop and search for for youth, you know, instead yeah, of having. Yeah, to... yeah. So, so they're already doing that, though, aren't they? Stop and search. No, no, they're going to start. Well, I hope, and I hope it does get pushed through. That needs some new legislation that the government are starting to, you know, actually up the game a little bit more to stop these knives on the street. That's what we need, and that's what Danny T- Danny Tomo stood there and said. And that's what. Ty- um, that's well, I, what I, um, I, but I thought they food. banned those Rambo knives. Now you can't buy them online, and well, I, I don't understand how you're going to stop some kid getting a kitchen knife from his kitchen. Look, how are you going to stop that? Well, okay then. Well, let's let's not do anything then, Amza. But why let's now? Let's not do anything. Let's not do anything. Let's just sit there and let, let it continue. We've got to try. We've got to try. There's too many innocent children out there getting killed. What are you talking about? No, I, I agree with you. Right then, so if, you agree if, with if, me. If this is your cause... If, okay, well, that's, so that's, 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 no, no, no. If your cause has got nothing to do with Muslims... Look, if your cause has got nothing to do with Islam and Muslims, and your cause is about tackling knife crime, yeah? Mm-hmm. You've answered my question, and it's fantastic. Well, that's what Tommy Robinson's been saying. That's what Danny Tomo's well, been saying. That's not what Tommy Robinson's supporters have been telling me on this live, mate. Well, you you say what you want, but if you no, I'm actually... not saying what I want. I asked the question. Well, they they give say me the what answers. They, they can say what they want, but Tommy Robinson and Danny Tomo clearly stated the reason they are there, and and what what's what this is about. If anyone else is coming in here being racist or being you know, Islamophobic or causing you guys trouble. They're just trolls and just being idiots. That is not no, what No, no, said, no, no, no. They came on the live stream and they mm. answered the question. Well, well, they've answered the, well, they've answered the wrong question because that is not the message. Well, no, they talk not. about grooming gangs and this and that. Well, that, well, that's nothing to do with a match, is it? No. Exactly. I'm just trying so to understand why, why, why what's got smashed up. up. If, if your conversation's about what's a match is about, you just said, no, well, that's no. nothing to do with a match, I'm out. If your march is about stopping knife crime, that's what I'd it have is. to march with you. Well, please do. I want to see you at the next one, yeah, Hamza? Deal? If, well, if that's please what you're do. marching please. about. No, but that's what, guys, I'm playing, I'm going to play the video. Please, listen, 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 Danny Tomo. People are going to want to do stuff. Listen. The plan is we're going to get behind the banner and we're going to march back down there. You're allowed to. Yeah. A country that you cannot accept. Listen. This is what happened. Unite under the flag of the United Kingdom. Unite the kingdom against what we're seeing right now. We have to do these things. They have to know that we're here and we're willing to step in at any point. Because what we're seeing is young girls dying on the streets of our country. And now look, within one day, look who's turned up to fight the right way for their country. Does it say anything there about Muslims? That's we're here against Muslims? No, it doesn't. I didn't say it was. No. But you guys all assume... Tommy Don't give me you guys. Why are you assuming me? Okay, I, you I guys, sorry, 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 my bad, my apologies. You... You're doing exactly what you're okay. accusing okay. me of. Okay, my bad, and I apologise. You get it wrong. You've got it wrong. Tommy whoa, Robinson... Whoa, 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 stop saying I got it wrong. I ain't said anything. Well, well, you have, because you clearly... If you're going to be with us on the next match, I want to see their hands. Well, no, I've got this recorded. I can't with people singing Allah, Allah, who the fuck is Allah. So, no, Did I, I, I didn't hear that. You. I didn't hear that. Did you hear that then? I heard it at the march, mate. England, England. The, to you, that's racist, them screaming England, isn't it? What? Do you, do you like them screaming, we want our country back? I don't even understand what it means. Well, I've just told you. It means we want. No, you, to, you told me some nonsense that doesn't make it's any not sense. Nonsense. It means we want. There was it back never to the way a world. utopia when there was no crime. 
Okay, I'm not. Yeah, I heard one guy. Talking. I heard one guy. I'll be honest with you. I heard one guy having an interview with um, who is he talking to? Um, Julia Hartley Brewer, and he says he remembers when the villages were when the people were as white as snow. I was like, what? Are you serious? Okay. Yeah, so he back. actually was reminiscing of mm -hmm. when the everyone was white. Okay, Andrew, you're going to come. I'm not coming. I'm not coming to oh, any march to that abuses that? Islam, matey. Okay. What about what about this then? Right. There needs to be a movement in this country. Would you agree to unite Muslims and everybody else? Because let's be honest, you everyone seems to be attacking Muslims, and I do see it. Well, I'm not lying. I do see a lot of attacks getting chucked your way, and it's not nice. Do not think there needs to be a movement which unites everybody together against the government's ruling. And if you you can think all you want that there's no change, the government's fine, blah, blah, blah. The government has a lot to answer for. Do you not think we should all unite? Uh, unite against who? Mr. Bean. I mean, are you listening? I'm talking I'm about... listening to you. Are, are you telling me? I, I don't understand what, what the government said about knife crime. What's nothing. their position? That's the problem. Nothing. They're doing nothing about they're it. No, they're nothing. Let me, let me well, just see what this? the Labour have said. Watch this, right watch this. What, I'm ready for this. Ready for this. So them children, God bless the souls, yeah? The yeah. angels are no longer with us, right? Yeah. Right. What's the first thing? What's the first time he came onto um, our TVs and said, what did he do? Instead of, he should be focusing actually bringing out a new legislation against knife crime. He sat there and he said, I'm going to, we're going to go into war more or less with the British public because they're angry. Why don't you stop worrying about the British public at the uh, moment? Focus on the legislation, which needs to be put in place to stop children walking around with knives. Let me, let me, let me, let me just read something. Why don't we do that? Why don't we focus on that bit? Because that's the bit. What's no, but listen, but listen, but listen, just listen. Yeah. We need to take back our streets from a rising epidemic of knife crime. In 2022, mm. 282 people were fatally stabbed. The wow. steepest increase in knife crime are in our towns and suburbs. Mm -hmm. So this is no longer a problem confined to our cities. Right. A 15-year-old girl on her way to school in Croydon who never made it to the school gate. A teenager who died in a hospital car park in Cornwall. Yet mm -hmm. the charges against his alleged killer were later dropped. A 16-year-old boy stabbed to death just hard from his yards from his home in Wolverhampton. Yeah. A 74-year-old man who worked for his local council driving special needs children to school fatally stabbed while walking his dog near Mosby. One second, one second, one second, one second. And on New Year's Eve in London, a 16-year-old who gathered with friends to watch the fireworks from Primrose Hill was pronounced dead before midnight. Mm -hmm. In Britain, we often pat ourselves on the back that we don't have America's gun violence crisis. Yet in plain sight, we are now witnessing our own crisis mm -hmm. and a horrific growth in knife crime and stabbings and not enough is being done to stop it. Knife crime affects not just the direct victim, it affects the whole community. Exactly. It is about the fear of crime as well as the crime itself. The dread of walking home alone in the dark, the belief of a growing number of teenagers that they need to carry a knife to protect themselves. The sense that their community is unsafe. Too often nothing is done where there are signs that a young person is getting into trouble, being groomed by gangs or lost into a dangerous online world. Labour will turn this around. We will give young people real support to achieve their potential and stay on track. But we'll flout that chance and they'll feel the full force of the law. Too often when teenagers are caught with knives, nothing happens. Too often there is no action. No support to stop a spiral into even more devastating oh. crime. Too often when teenagers say they don't feel safe or they are struggling themselves with trauma or abuse, no one listens, no help is provided. The Tories have said they'll act 16 times in the last decade to stop the selling of dangerous knives. Yet it's still easier to buy a lethal zombie style knife online than it is to buy a kitchen knife on the high street. Knife crime is yet another crushing example of us all paying the price for Tory sticking plaster politics and ultimately their negligence. Are we really surprised if we cut the numbers of neighborhood police and PSO, PCSOs, close down youth clubs, disempower local councils, beat a retreat from the public parks, estates and high streets, then this is fertile grounds for crime and antisocial behavior to flourish and criminal gangs to fill the void. This is the Labour site, mate. This is Labour telling you they're going to tackle this. This is the Labour telling you they've recognized the, the epidemic. Down, right? They've recognized the one second. They've recognized the problem. They've recognized the causes and the sources of the problem. And uh. they're claiming that they're going to do something about it. Tommy, Danny Tommel could have wrote that. It's the same rhetoric. There we go. So it proves that they're not going to do anything. Well, no, that so demonstrates that they're going to do something. 
Oh, so you believe that then? Yeah. So you nitpick. You believe one thing and you believe that you don't believe in X. Yeah? What, what, what am I nitpicking? So you believe that, yeah? Is that what you're saying? Uh, do I believe that Labour have recognised that there's knife crime yeah, and yeah, that the causes yeah, of knife crime yeah. and that they're going to do things to eradicate yeah. knife crime? Or, yeah, yeah, why not? Why wouldn't I believe it? There we go, guys. And, he's, if, if, and he well, believes... Why don't you believe it? i tell you why, because these suckers have lied to us for so long. What they lied fucking... about? What, what's Labour lied to you about? Listen, Amza, Amza, have you heard what you are saying? Yes, what they lied to you about? Ready, ready. ready. I'm going to say this, and you, I want you to respond, right? Oh. As a Prime Minister, do you think, say you as a Prime Minister, you've just found out on the streets of our country that three little angels, yeah, are no longer with us because of a knife, of, uh, uh, of a, a twisted, sick individual has killed three girls, yeah? What is the? Th what would you do as, as, as first things first as Prime Minister? What would you do? What would you do? What 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 do you think what you could have do? Done? What would you do as prime? You would try your best. Surely, if you care for these people, you would try your best to say, "Listen, we've had enough." And not only that, two days later there was a big sword fight and a lot of axes and everyone chucking knives at each other. There was a clear, clear problem. It's highlighted. It's standing out like a sore thumb. And you, as a prime minister, if you was prime minister, surely you would go right. We need to sit down and figure out a plan because if people are running around too much, willing nilly with knives, thinking they can get away with it. So what are we going to do? But yeah, as he said, oh, okay. at all. Look, 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 look. If this, this is, is what, what look, 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 if this is what this protest is all about, yeah, it's not an issue. That, well, that is exactly what it's about. Okay. Let, let's, let's not, and, so. and, if you, and if anybody thinks anything different, please, I will sit here right now and I want you to bring them all in the box and I can bet you any money you want that not once has Tommy Robinson or Danny Tomo sat there and said, Muslims are the problem. But it's not the problem. No, about this, about this knife crime. What's this no, 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 we, no, but if the guy was a Muslim... I'm talking then. about now. I'm talking Look, about with this situation. We both know what would have happened if this guy was a Muslim, mate. But you can speculate all you want, but right now, never once have they said this was a Muslim problem. Never once. They said it was it, it was um, a legal immigration problem. It, uh, all the hotels are, that's what they said. So, uh, so no, let's, the, 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 let's stop playing the victim. Let's no, but the thing, is this, the thing is this, you see. I'm confused whether it's legal immigration or illegal immigration I'm illegal confused. immigration illegal immigration that's the problem so why is it every time i see some someone with a brown face it says send them all who said this there's so many memes and comments throughout well, again that's not tommy you, 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 you guys you've just said you started this live up for people to edl supporters to come no, in yeah, yeah, and i wanted to hear look, look. edl don't even exist anymore what are you talking about you, the supporters of edl still exist mate don't the supporters of what EDL edl's not there that's like saying supporters of islam and say they oh, exist okay, you can't so Look, look, look. That's like it saying uh, Al Mahajaroon don't exist anymore, but they're clearly they did. Because okay, I didn't okay, okay then. So let me ask you this then. Let me ask you this, all right? Tommy Ro again, I'll wait. If anyone wants to jump in a box and show me a clip, I'll give you 500 quid right now. If Tommy Robinson or Danny Tomo ever, these were the ones running this and, and, and leading the way on this, if they ever once sat there and said, this is a Muslim problem, this is an Islam problem, and show me. You all go quiet because you know it hasn't been. So stop playing victim. Stop oh, okay. making out oh, okay. as if the Muslims have got attacked first, for this. Isn't it? First thing, first thing. It never happened that that that, that attack on that first mosque. First thing. It should never have happened. And first you know thing. what? The first people to help people. in Southport to attack yeah. a mosque. I it's, think. And, in then, the and then the day people, after, the Christians one second, were there. One second, one second, one second. If a protest in in Southport, you attack a mosque. A protest in Hartlepool, attack a mosque. Yeah. You have a, a protest in London and chants are heard of Allah, Allah, who the fuck is Allah? Yeah. And you think that we're not going to think, hmm, it's a bit fishy here. Okay. Like, really? That's you, think a, we're not, you don't think that's we're like going to. You don't, you don't think we're going to. And look, yeah. have you seen a reaction from the Muslim community yet? No. Well, have we not? No. You've not seen have a reaction. You've scrolled down your FYP on TikTok, mate. You've not seen a reaction from the Muslim community. All right, so what is that a threat? Is that like, a, well, you better be ready, we're coming. Like, is well, that, that's not a reaction we want. No, no, no. We need peace, okay? okay? Listen, when the Muslims react, yeah, they do to the EDL like they did in Birmingham, like they did in Harrow, yeah? Like, like they did in Leeds, run away, yeah? Like that one. What, who? Well, please run away from in Leeds, yeah? Like no, no, that no, one. no, 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 no. I'm saying when Muslims react. Mus Leeds wasn't Muslims. Leeds was Roma Gypsies. Okay. No. You're what? watching the wrong video, my friend. Whoa, 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 whoa. Leeds was not Muslims, mate. 
No, I know it wasn't the, 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 the reason wasn't, but you go and watch that video and you'll see what I'm talking about. You'll see Muslims in that video stopping the violence, yes. All right, well then. That's the, MP, the MP for Leeds, the recently voted in MP, was putting out fires, mate. What are you talking about? Right, okay. Right, right. So they, and they were, pre, they were shouting at them, saying, this is our community, okay. what are you okay. doing? So do you believe, do you believe, Tommy there's Robinson? They're saying, there's children in these houses, what are you doing? the subject, Tamza. Do you right, believe right, Tommy right. Robinson, and Danny who, No, 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 I'm going to let you fly by that now. So okay. Leeds, okay. Leeds was riots by Roma gypsies based yeah, upon really. children of theirs being taken by social services. And they're yeah. the ones who were rioting. They're the ones attacking the police. They're the ones that chased okay. the police out of town. Okay. Muslims who were there were preventing what was okay. going on. So you should be applauding the Muslims in Leeds. First thing. What I just said to you yeah. is when the EDL came to, well, not the EDL, it was a stop mm -hmm. Islamification of Europe. In, when they came to Harrow Mosque, they see what Muslim yeah. reaction is. When the when they, uh, EDL came to Birmingham, they saw what Muslim reaction is. Right now, the Muslims are not reacting. But if you start attacking their places of worship, inshallah, you don't. Yeah, Because I fear that's what's trying, they're trying to spark this, that you want this kind of, no, Mr. Yeah. you, but some people want this reaction from the Muslim youth. And Alhamdulillah, they haven't responded. They haven't reacted. Yeah. And that's because why? Because they know the pain and suffering that you guys after Southport are feeling based upon those three girls. Because they know through Palestine that kind of suffering. So we appreciate and understand why you would be hurting. Okay. You don't ready? understand. Are you ready? Hamza, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just uh, proper just embarrass you. You cannot embarrass me, mate. Are you ready? Yeah. You claimed then it wasn't Muslims who did anything. Are you ready? Didn't Muslims, Muslims do everything Muslims, where? Ready, in Leeds. You said it in wasn't Leeds. Muslims. Yeah. All, all, all you said was Muslims putting out the fires. That's what you said. Yeah. Right. Lustin Dobry, 37, has been charged in connection with... In the, um, with, with hear me out. Okay? He's a Muslim man who set fire to the police off, uh, police van. Muslim what man. He? Yes, he was. He's What's in the. Name? Oh, because his name's not Mohammed, is that what it is? No, what was his name? Lustin Dobry, 37. Okay. Lustin Dobry. It's in the Independent, it's in all well, the... All it the identifies as a Muslim. Well, well, that's what he's saying, okay? So, well, 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 where's it saying it? In the Independent? Go to the Independent, just type it in. So, I, I will what's his name? Spell it. Lustin Dobry, L-U-S-T-I-N, Dobry, 37. Lustin Dobry. Oh, a Muslim, yeah. And he goes by another, he goes by another name. Okay, let's uh, okay, Lustin Dobri. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, except all, oh, why is it going to be TikTok? I don't want to see it on TikTok. One second, um, I don't trust okay. them. Okay, so going back to the you can find no, that. No, 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 let's stay, I, I we'll stay make, on this topic. Yeah, one second, on we'll, we'll stay on this topic. One second, okay, because Lustin Dobri doesn't sound like okay. a Muslim name, mate. Okay, okay, well, look, right. Look, let's. I want to one get second, to one the, second, one second, one second, one second. It's at twenty to five. I'm trying to get to my point still. I knew this yeah, is what you do. You knew I would fact check. You knew. You. No, yeah, no, you, you should that. know. You, you should know. I'm going to fact check your, you. Yes. Your, question, your question is, what is uh, all these marches about? You could have just googled it, but yet you've decided to come online. Where, where can I Google what the march is about? What, go on to YouTube and type it in. Just go. On, go oh, on, okay. Go. Let me read it for you. Romanian gypsy Lustin Dobri. Charged with violent disorder and reckless arson. What paper are you reading? Uh, this is based upon... His picture is there. Yeah. Oh, because oh, he's got brown skin. You thought he was a Muslim. Bless no, you. I didn't. See, again, Bless you're jumping you. the race card. You're jumping the race card. Bless you. Oh, no, I didn't say that. Bars. See? No, 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 bless me. Bars, that guy's a Romanian. I can see. I don't even have to look at his bloody okay, birth okay, certificate. Okay, okay, okay. No, that's not true. Right, anyway. Look, Rum okay. Romanian gypsy, Lustin Dobri, charged with violent reason. disorder and reckless arson while what wearing Team MKM 24 reading? shirt to burn down double decker bus on fire okay. while riot. What, what, what paper are you reading? <sighs> Another paper. Again, we've established tonight you believe that what the papers oh, believe. Oh, my God. Oh, I feel so sorry for you, man. Okay, okay. Okay. I feel can so get, sorry for you. Can I get you to my point now? Brown face. See, this is what you do. This is All what right. you do. You All never right. One second, one second, one second. And this is what I do. I fact check no, your nonsense. Fact yes. checking. Right now, I'm highlighting the fact You're that talking you talking nonsense, make... mate. Let me explain. Okay, let me read it. Let me read it. This is in the uh, Telegraph and Argus. Yeah? There one we second, go, guys, again. I'm going to leave. I'm one second, gonna, one second. Let me finish my point. No, 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 no. This is what it does, guys. I'm reading it. I'm reading it. I'm reading it. You read it. You enjoy it. Prove my point again. All right. Thank you. I'll see you later then, yeah? Good. All right. 
A man accused of violent disorder after disturbances in Leeds suburbs intends to deny the charges a court has been told. Just Justin Dobre, 37 of Leeds, was charged with setting a bus on fire by standing next to it with a lighter during disorder in Hare Hills last Thursday night. On Monday, he appeared at Leeds Magistrate Court charged with violent disorder and arson with recklessness as to whether life was endangered. The court heard Dobre, a Romanian national, as indicated he will plead guilty to the he will not plead guilty to the charges. All right, come on, man. Uh, it's like, come on. He saw a picture of a brown face and he assumed he was a Muslim. His name is this is not a Muslim name. It, it's terrible. It's terrible. So his example of Leeds and Muslims and embarrassment, it just ain't happening. <sighs> Anyone wants to fact check it? His name is Justin Dobri, a Romanian national. And guess what? He should be deported. I agree. If he's doing that.